Hi and welcome back. So in this video we're going to have a look at Chief O'Neill's favourite and the planes of Boyle and we're going to look at advanced techniques and ornamentation. These techniques are to make the songs more interesting for you to play and more interesting for people to listen to so I hope you enjoy them. If you haven't learned Chief O'Neill's favourite yet I'll put a link on screen now. You can go to the tutorial video and learn it there and if you need to learn the planes of Boyle I'll put a link on screen here now and you can go and learn that one. If there's any tunes you'd like us to have a look at, either for ornamentation and advanced techniques, or just tunes you want to learn in general, drop a comment down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks very much. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll get straight into the two tunes, and at the end I'll play the two hornpipes for you with some of the variation and ornamentation at a slow pace, and you can get a feel for what they should sound like or play along. Okay, so here we go, Chief O'Neill's favourite and the Plains of Boyle. Okay, Chief O'Neill's favourite first, what have we got? Immediately we take the F sharp, E, F sharp and turn that into a treble and I'm stuttering it. Again that first bar. So the a, G, we can put the A and the F sharp, sorry, we can put a G in the middle, make a triplet out of it. But a better one is the G, F sharp, E triplet straight after it. I would often let the A go and put the triplet in there, but you can do both. Which is fine. You can also pause the A, which is cutting the F sharp out altogether. It doesn't work so well at the beginning of the tune, but better at an ending. The F sharp to the D, F sharp E D triplet. So yeah, there's that triplet. C natural B A triplet and then I'm putting a chord in there of A and E and then at the end F sharp G A this is a real whistle kind of pipers technique but it does work so F sharp G A triplet and then on the two D's you can treble them, you can play them as D, A chords, you've got choices. Second part, I like to hit that F natural with an A to give it that kind of D minor feel. You can also treble it. And then we're going to treble the C natural B, A, uh, sorry, triplet it. phrase again C B A triplet chord on the A and then we're back into the bit we already know that's Chief O'Neill's favorite let's move on to the planes of Boyle what have we got in here yeah not much we can do treble that long A, so we'll do a G F sharp E triplet on the first one and then that C natural to A will triple, treble, tri triplet that as well. Let's take the whole of Plains of Boyle again. Okay, Plains of Boyle, what have we got? That's all I do in those first two bars, just put a tre uh, treble on the A. Then we've got a triplet here of G, F sharp, E. And 
then C, B, A triplet. None of that's any different. So there's last two bars, last couple of phrases. G, F sharp, E triplet. Treble the A. And then the A, F sharp, sorry, F sharp, G, A triplet. And then the two Ds, you can treble them or you can play them as a D, A chord. Into the B part. Okay, uh, treble the G. Or make it into a triplet. Which is probably a bit nicer. G, A, G triplet. You can also play as a chord, which is just G, G and B, or G and D. Mm, leave all of that the same. Okay, so we're going to turn all of those into triplets. Or their trebles at the moment, we can turn them into triplets by doing this. I'm actually pulling off my triplet. It's A, A, B, A, and I'm pulling off the last A. And then it repeats. So yeah, we've got a long A roll there. And then we finish with the A, F sharp, sorry, the F sharp, G, A triplet, and two long Ds. And that's all the advanced parts I've got for you. Okay, so I hope there was lots of useful techniques in those videos. I'll play through the two horn pipes now nice and slow. You can get a listen to them and see if there's anything in there you'd like to put into your own playing. So Chief O'Neill's favorite first, playing to boil afterwards. One, two, three, Thanks very much. Hope you enjoyed these and I'll see you in the next video.